when I see almost any mirror, that's why I have to pretty much avoid it, I stop, I look to make sure everything's perfect. If sometimes I, if I focus on not looking, then sometimes I can avoid it. But if I see myself or catch a glimpse that my hair is not straight, that a wrinkle on my face is showing, that a freckle is showing, anything, I will have to fix it. I will have to immediately do something or I get upset. <laughs> Why I drink my Diet Coke out of a styrofoam cup? Okay, because it doesn't break my teeth, because I bang glasses against my teeth and I have already chipped this one about three or four times and I keep getting it fixed. I broke it again last week and um, so I have to drink either out of a styrofoam cup or a glass with a straw, but preferably both. That way I avoid banging at all costs. I, if I'm going to drink a glass, if I'm a glass, I drink it, and then I touch it, and I do it, I have to do it. Like five times. In sequences of five, I know that was more than five. Just until it feels just right. And if it doesn't feel just right, then I can go through the whole thing again. I can dwell on the fact for hours if, if I, you know, don't get it to where it just feels perfect. Therefore, I avoid it by drinking out of a straw. If I were to put a glass down and somebody were to scrape it across like that, I personally would never do something like that because it drives me up the wall. I feel that the glass and the counter both have, both have feelings. Like you have feelings in your hand or you know, and, and if you scratch something, you can feel that. Well, with me, I would ha I scrape off the feelings off the counter, and then I have to put the feelings back on, so it's perfect. I mean, everything has to be, it has to feel just right. But if, if it goes this way, then it's the same thing, I have to put it back. Everything has to, everything has its place. 